Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome. This is Dan. Thank you for joining me for Nancy Drew. Warnings at Waverly Academy yet again. So uh, behind the scenes, just a little backstage uh, talk here. Um, I know for all of you, this is uh, just the next episode. But for me, this has actually been half a year since episode one. Uh, in that time, I, and well, my wife really had uh, twins. So it's been incredibly, incredibly busy. And um, just now, I found a little bit of time where the kids are sleeping and now I'm able to do something about it. I, <laughs> I can't guarantee that they're going to stay asleep, but, um, you know, in the, in the time that they're, uh, they are sleeping, I'm going to try to get some gaming in. Um, I have a little camera on the side here. So if you see a cut or something, that's, I probably want to go take care of that. Uh, but yeah, they're very young and, um, uh, I'm trying to get some gaming in and uh, post up on my channel. Uh, it's not a dead channel. At least I'm hoping it won't be a dead channel. I am continuing to try to put videos up. But, man, it's been a, a while since the last game. Fortunately, I did do a little bit of um, editing uh, for episode one. So I, I do know that I came here to the library to one meet with Izzy, I think her name was, and also to use the library computer. Uh, we have some pictures that we have taken of other students at the school, and uh, we need to upload them for, oh man, I forget her name. Uh, Margaret, was it Margaret? Uh, what's her name? Uh... Dang it, what was her name? Jeez. Rachel? Was that her name? Yes, pictures for Rachel. There we go. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, we connect the, the phone to... Yep, connect the phone here. Uh, Waverly website? Library, what's in the library catalog? All right, Waverly Academy library page. The Jasmine Ivy Library is a state-of-the-art resource center that deserves the entire campus. Located in Ramsey Hall, the recently renovated library boasts new wireless connections and an interlibrary loan system that connects millions, oh, connects students with millions of books statewide. The school's own collection contains more than 20,000 items, including books, video CDs, and DVDs, as well as over 100 periodicals. In addition to providing students with the resources needed to pursue their studies and interests, the library serves as one of the most popular meeting places on campus. Really? Well, I guess if it's a prestigious academy, that would be the case, because uh, if it's prestigious, people are trying to do well in these uh these schools and the parents are certainly paying a lot of money for a place like this with carols tables and chairs spread throughout the room students are provided with a comfortable and conducive area for both group and individual study a public computer is reserved for library catalog and school website access all other internet access is available through the wireless network on students personal laptops which nancy does not have Hours are 6 to 10.30, uh, Monday through Thursday, and then Friday through Sunday, 6 to 11. Longer on the weekend, and I wonder why. Uh-oh. Password. Okay. Forgot password? Ah, uh, Steve, the student body president. All right. Uh, so can't go to home. Can we not? Can we not do anything else there? We need. We need to log in. Student body president. That was. Um, man, uh, I was only thinking of Izzy, but the it's a uh, student body president. That's the person who gave us the demerits when we looked out the window. Okay. Did did we get a password? I don't think we got a password, right? 
Mel told me the sampler hanging in her room was made by one of the original students here. Mel, that was the one with the, uh, was that a cello that she had? Corinne says Waverly's got a very strict demerit system that's enforced by some- Paige! That's it. That's who it was. I better hit the computer in the library and read up on the rules around here. Last thing I need is to wind up in trouble. Mel's roommate, Megan Vargas, must be the one whose parents are threatening to sue if Black Cat isn't caught soon. Don't blame them. Causing someone to suffer a severe allergic reaction goes beyond a practical joke. I promised Ned I'd call him as soon as I had something interesting to report. Too bad I can't call Bess. She and George are sh snowshoeing? at their aunt's cabin in Wisconsin. The headmistress at Waverly Academy sent tickets to fly out here today. Okay. So we've got phone numbers. That's cool. We've got the numbers in case we need to remember that because that's not going to be me. Clues. Okay. Apparently only girls who live in Ramsey Hall have been getting notes. Okay. Suspects. She doesn't like Izzy. Alright, so I don't have any I don't have any pa uh, password for this. Yeah, I gotta go talk to the student body president, so that's that's out. Alright, well uh, away we go. I'll go back one more. Hmm. One second, guys. I'm hearing some kind of... I thought I was hearing a noise. I'm not hearing it anymore. Okay, well, maybe it was just me, I guess. Okay, so... I'm trying to get my bearings here. I just wanted to turn. I didn't want to, like, move anywhere just yet. I wanted to see if there was some stuff that I could be missing here. All right. So here we have something we could interact with over here, too. Okay. And then over here, I think this is Izzy. She asked us to meet with her. Oh, there's something here, too. What is this? Reference books. And look, there's something here. It's like just hanging out. But that doesn't look like what we're looking for. Reference books. Nothing here stands out to me. Oh, no. Never mind. I thought something came up, but that was just to get out of this area here. Maybe we need to trigger something in order for this to work. I feel like it would be this book, though. It's like staring at us right now, practically. Anyways, and then there's the way out. All right, let's go talk to Izzy. Or actually, I'm going to check out this other thing over here first. Let's see. I see there's a display case here. Anything else? No. Okay. Okay, so we can go forward toward the display cabinet. There doesn't seem to be anything else around here I can interact with. The Story of Four by Madeline Moore. Oh! Oh, oh! That's the... That's the thing... With uh, Mel's room hanging. Uh, I don't remember what it said specifically. Um, is it in here? No. But it said something about the, the story of Moore. Looks like I need a key. And it's locked, of course. But yeah, I think this is what we need. Oh, what's this? Okay, never mind. That's just to... Just to... Oh, what? What? Oh my god, there's active time? Uh-oh. I don't know that that's good. 
I think we're gonna get in trouble here. I didn't know there was a timer! There's some kind of timer going on? 504. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's talk to her. Bonjour! Unfortunately, that and Chouette Laura are all the French I know. Hey, my condolences on your roommate assignment. You know, it might not be too late to get it changed. Well, yeah, everybody seems to think she's awkward, which is, to be fair, it's kind of true. You don't like Corrine either? Nobody likes Corrine. Why not? Because she's Corrine. And Corrine is just not cool. But look, don't worry. Everyone knows rooming with Corrine wasn't your idea. As long as you don't hang out with her, nobody's going to hold it against you. Wow. This is, uh, this is why I don't miss high school. High school is so totally like this. Do you like your roommate? My roommate's Lila Yadev. Athletic superstar and savior of Waverly's athletic program. We actually get along fine. Probably because we're pretty much equals. Everyone knows who she is, and everyone knows who I am. A word to the wise. Avoid hanging out with your roommate as much as possible. Oh yeah, she's supposed to be the manipulative bee or whatever. Okay, that's, that's, yeah, that's gonna be awesome. All right, well, we need to take a close-up picture. Okay, if I take a close-up of you, Rachel needs it for the school website. Rachel roped you into helping her, huh? Lucky you. Your first day, you get to spend it with every loser in our class. Ooh, Ready ouch. for my close-up, darling. Darling. Okay, let's see. Zoom in. Take a photo. I said I'm ready. I've already taken it. Jeez. I get the impression Rachel's not one of your favorite people. She's no one's favorite people. Even Kareen doesn't like her. Well, as I was editing the video, I remember that apparently somehow she is in the running to be valedictorian, even though she's not done very well in one of her classes. So that is kind of weird. She seems nice enough. She has no business being here, either socially or academically, and she knows it. She makes no effort to fit in because she knows she never will. <laughs> Gotta give her that much. Oh, oh, here's the password thing. Apparently, I need to get a password from you before I can use the school's computer. That's right. Unfortunately, I need to finish this DNA model before I can give it to you. Too bad, huh? Ah, uh, here's the manipulativeness. I bet she wants us to finish her assignment for her so she doesn't have to do it. And she's hanging our password as a form of uh, uh, coercion, I think. I'm, I, man, my words are starting to get away from me. Is that a sign of age or is that a sign of just me being a dum-dum? I can't get it from anyone else? No, of course not. Nope. All right. Well, I will hit this one up later. What's your take on Mel? What's your take on Mel? All that edgy, free spirit, deep thinking stuff is just an act. She knows she can't cut it here, so she's making it look like she doesn't care. Mm, I don't know. I feel like she's the type that probably doesn't care. Maybe she really doesn't care. Everybody cares what other people think. In fact, if they don't, they're psychopaths. I just learned that in AP Psych. They don't teach you that. That's just what you came away with. Have you gotten any notes from the black cat? Everyone on the Valcan floor has. The valedictorian candidate floor. I, I floor. figured that. I figured that. Except for us, because we haven't gotten anything. Has anything like this ever happened before? Not as far as I know. Although... Although... Supposedly, there was a teacher here once, a long time ago, that none of the students liked. They were always playing tricks on her, scaring her and stuff, until one day one of their pranks gave her a heart attack and she died. So you're thinking Her black ghost? cat went running off into the woods during the funeral and never came back. But for years after that, people would spot it lurking in the shadows. And whenever they did, something bad would happen. They said it was the teacher, Miss Hallowell, coming back as her cat to get revenge. 
somebody around here is obviously trying to get some mileage out of a silly ghost story. One the headmistress is trying desperately to squelch, by the way. So remember, you didn't hear it from me. Oh, sure, 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 I didn't, sure. But yeah, I, a ghost? Really? Really a ghost? And besides, black cats have notoriously been known to be symbols of bad luck, so it's like, okay... Uh, oh, this black hat is bad luck. Uh, yeah, everybody's gonna assume that anyways. All right, let's see about your homework. If I help you with your DNA homework, will you give me that computer password? Sure, you bet. Excellent idea. Okay, here's what you need to do. You just have to make sure adenine is always paired with thymine and cytosine is always paired with guanine. And make sure each pair is connected to a sugar on the alternating sugar phosphate side. Just jump in, you'll figure it out. When you're done, bring it back, and if you get it right, I'll tell you the password. Sounds good. What? What else is going on? Any idea who the black cat is? It's Mel. See, like I said, she's a little psycho. And black cats, strange mishaps, it all fits in with that inane goth thing she's got going. I mean, who else could it be? I don't know. Mel doesn't strike me as that type of person. I've harassed you enough. Pop in any time. All right, let's take a look at her molecule thing here. All right, so... Right-click to rotate. What were the instructions again? Um, so adenine and thymine are t together and cytosine and guanine are together. I don't remember what she said about the sugar and phosphate. Um, okay. Oh, here it is. Okay. Uh, I just have to make sure adenine is always paired with thymine and cytosine always paired with guanine and make sure each pair is connected to a sugar on the alternating sugar phosphate sides. To a sugar on the alternating... Okay, so sugar and phosphate have to go together. And then those molecules have to... Okay. So... Looks like sugar and phosphate are already together in most of these. Alright, so... Let's see. It looks like red, cytosine, needs to go with the guanine, which is blue. And that needs to connect to a white because the sugar molecules are larger than the phosphate molecules, which are brown. So I need to find a blue one at a corner here. And the blue has to connect to a white like this. And now, let's see, yellow is adenine that needs to connect to a thymine. So, something like this. Yes. Alright. So now, this is blue. That's guanine. That goes with cytosine, which is red. But that needs to connect to a sugar. Uh, no, not this one. Okay, so this is the only other one, then. Alright, there we go. So I need a... Phosphate sugar. Well, let's not go with that one. Um, black. Black is thymine. That goes with adenine. So it's red. And then sugar. So. Nope. Huh? Um. Interesting. Oh, the entire, all the uh, way around, it's sugar and phosphate. Okay. And the only ones in the middle here are the, the pears. Okay. I get you. I get you. 
I get it. Okay, so yellow and black. So not this one. It's got to be more of a T. Here we go. Like this. It wouldn't have been this one. Okay. 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 Uh, let's see. What else have we got here? Uh, it's difficult. Difficult to say. Um, I need something here. Okay. So, I mean, this one could work in that section as well as this one could also work. Um... See, this one is a base pair on its own. I it can't go here because then we need a free phosphate in this one. And it's the same here. Can it fit? Uh, well, it'd have to go fit this way, I guess. Oh, geez. Okay. Um, I think this would also have to fit down here somewhere because these ones got to get two of these fossil oh sugar ones in a row that are missing but that only occurs down here so it's this one can't be this one because this one already has one can't be this one because this has one so it's this one uh no because i need a free all right so i messed up somewhere uh, how do I reset? Is there a way to reset? Oh, can I just back out? Okay, there we go. All right, back out. Back at it. Okay. All right, all right, all right. All right, let's try this again. Oh, wait. Oh, oh okay. Okay. All right. Um... Okay, so it doesn't reset. I have to remove these things myself. Okay. Okay. All right, all right. And I think these were all the ones that started. Yes, okay. All right, red goes with blue. Red goes with blue. Okay, so let's get a blue one. And the blue one needs to connect to white. So it's not this. This one works. Uh, and this one does not. And blue needs to connect to white because there's no blue one all on its own. Nor is there... This one doesn't work either because it's... Um, at a, there's no angle here because the blue has to connect to the white. So it's got to be this one. This one has to be right. This one has to be okay. And then this one is a red. So it could be this one. Could it be this one? No, it can't be this one. And it could not be this one because the red needs to connect to white here at the top. So this one has to be here. Okay. So black uh, has to connect with yellow. So, not that, not this, not this, and not this. So, oh wait, I'm looking for the yellow ones. Come on, Dan. Okay. All right, so I'm looking for the yellow ones. But the yellow has to connect to a white. Could it be this one? No, because the yellow would have to go here. So it's not this one. Could it be this one? No, because there's an existing phosphate here, so it's not that one. So it could be, it could be this one. Uh, actually, that's I feel like that's what it would be, and then black would have to go here, so it'd have to be black, white, brown. Here we go. All right, there we go. There's that, and there's a base pair here. So red and red and blue black and yellow so this is only the base pair because the outsides here are done so blue and red are a base pair and these black ones do not this one yellow one is not and this one's connected to a white so it's got to be this one so that is either in this configuration oh no it is this configuration because 
look, the, there's a little thing sticking out of the red. And if I flip that, it would go like this, but it doesn't connect to the the white, the sugar. So this is the only way where this whole thing strings together and connects. All right, so this yellow one needs to connect to a black. So it could be this one. But that could also connect here. Um, hmm. Maybe instead let's go for this one. So need an angle shape that is brown yellow I mean brown white and then some other color so an angled piece so something like this brown white and then a colored piece oh, it could be either of these because both of these match that okay well let's assume it was this Let's assume it was this one, right? So it's black. Then this one would have to be like this for it to complete, right? Oh, well, look. This is just a brown. Okay. That kind of throws me off a little. All right, so this is a possibility. Uh, the reverse is also true, I suppose. Oh, no. Because if you look here, there's no connector here. So if this were to go in, it would have to go in this way. Does that work, though? This connector here goes to the brown, white, and this all connects down here. Yeah, okay, that works fine. And then maybe this connects? To here in the next one so blue red and then white and that connects here with the brown hmm so there's two of these interesting oh okay no wait Oh, man, dude. Okay. Okay, this is difficult. Um, Let's see here. This needs a black one. And the black has to connect to a white, which connects to a brown. So like this, except... There needs to be a little hanger off here on the brown because see it's not there's no one here so something like this or like this either of these could work down here but it, i don't know what goes into here hmm This one needs to connect, and either of these could... This needs to connect to a black, and either of these, again, works for this. Hmm. I think I'm going to just go with this as the correct one here, just kind of... So we have something to go off of. This one... Oh, no. Uh, actually, yeah, here we go. Okay, there we go. I was like, oh no, I can't connect these. But I can. Okay, so. And then maybe we can connect these. This brown singular one. Did we do it? Oh, we did it! Okay. How do I give this to her? It's fully complete, right? Oh, do I just talk to her? Is that it? Um, okay, let me just talk to her. Finished with that DNA model? You tell you me. You tell me. Awesome. Okay, your password is WAC Waverly Academy 5NE136. WAC 35NE136. Got it. Thanks. What else is going on? What do you think your chances are for making valedictorian? Chance has nothing to do with it. 
I deserve to be valedictorian. Therefore, I'm going to be valedictorian. Uh, that's not how the world works. What if there's a tie for the highest grade point average? It's not just a matter of getting the highest grades. The faculty also looks at extracurricular activities, leadership, community service, school spirit, things I totally excel at. But it also I'm going to be grades. valedictorian, and then I'm going to Harvard. Okay. I've harassed well. you enough. Pop in anytime. Sure. Sure. Anyways, we've got what we needed. Oh, I gotta type it in? Jeez. Good gravy. Um. That's done. Did that. Did that. Uh oh, whoa. Looks like Mel got another note. Oh, goth girl gets second black catted. That's what it says. Okay. So, Mel got a note. I'll have to talk to Mel in just a moment. Uh, no, not here. The notes, right? That's done. Uh, yeah, yeah, here we go. See, this was what I was talking about. Investigate the reference to Moore that was in that sampler in Mel's room. Yes, and it did refer to a book. Okay. Uh, I need a note. Uh, w A C. W A C three five N E one three six. Tell me it's uh, tell me it's case sensitive. Oh my god, it's not. I'm in charge of the snack shop. This should be interesting. I don't even know where it is. Announcement: Every student is assigned a school work study task. You are snack shop boss. Failure to perform this daily task will result in three demerits. My good gravy the black cat and other poe stories by edgar Allan poe has been stolen from the ivy special collections five credits to the individual who recovers and re returns the book to the library scheduled maintenance of the school's website will occur during prep week break numerous pages and most quick links will be inoperable during this time any student with information pertaining to the individuals responsible for the recent black cat notes and harmful pranks is to speak to the headmistress immediately. Waverly Academy is an exclusive private boarding school for girls grades 9 through 12 located in picturesque upstate New York. Waverly combines renowned academics, athletics, and arts with a strong social community. Quick links. Some of these are broken. Broken? 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 Broken. <laughs> About us. All right. Nestled in the picturesque setting of the Adirondacks, Waverly Academy is a world-renowned college preparatory boarding school exclusively for girls. Established in 1866, our rigorous academic curriculum and social community endows students with the skills and knowledge to succeed in their future endeavors. The story of Waverly begins shortly after the end of the Civil War. With the conflict over, attention once again turned to the importance of edu educating the youth of the day. Four influential women were inspired to create a school that would lead the nation in providing an unparalleled level of education for young girls. Dignitas in omnis. These founders, Harriet Ramsey, Rita Hallowell. Hey, Hallowell. We heard that name from um, Izzy. Uh, Mabel Whittier and Esther Abbott opened the doors and ushered in the first class of 14 girls in the fall of 1866. Today, Waverly Academy continues to embrace its mission statement for excellence in all facets of life. An exacting admissions process limits incoming class sizes to 50 students, allowing the girls to experience their studies in an intimate seminar setting with an average student-to-teacher ratio of 12 to 1. Much of the boarding experience takes place not in the classroom, but in the hours after the school day ends. Participation in the numerous clubs, activities, and athletics available, along with residential living, develop not only social and leadership skills, but lifelong friends. Come and discover the wondrous world of Waverly. We're waiting for you. Quick links. Broken. 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 Oh. Web page under construction. Check back later. 
You the are snack shop. Shoot, I totally forgot. By the end of the day. Uh, okay. Well, we'll, we'll have to do that. I, why Waverly? Admissions broken, 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 broken. Academics. English department announces the winner of the coveted pen to paper award. Read the winning essay here. Valedictorian race. Meet the candidates. Ah, I think this is where we need to uh, upload. See, there's like a button here. Uh, these are all the same? No, they're... Yeah, I think these are different. Uh, Waverly's academic program is designed to prepare graduates for success at college and beyond. An all-girls atmosphere provides a safe environment which enables students to focus on reaching their full potential. Our rigorous curriculum offers a wide range of courses intended to give each student a strong foundation in the traditional academic disciplines as well as a compendious exposure to the arts. Uh, in addition to the core classes, Waverly also offers numerous AP and honors levels as well as interest-specific independent studies, contributing in large part of the in contributing in large part of the academic success of each student is Waverly's renowned faculty. With a combined 200 plus years of experience, our dedicated teachers are ever willing to lend a hand to students. The low student teacher ratio allows strong supportive relationships to form, which in turn allows students to challenge themselves further than they ever dreamed possible. As our seniors cross below the arch on graduation day, 100% of the class matriculates into top colleges around the world, secure in their knowledge of academics, the arts, and themselves. Oh, that was working. Resources. Under construction. Everything else is broken. That's broken. Okay, here we go. Uh, how do I, so I thought I could download the photos or upload the photos. I can't, okay. Library page, student life. Ooh, double take. How fast are you? How fast can you make all the matches? What is this? Oh, uh. Oh, shoot. Oh, man. I, I don't know. I'm already lost. I don't know what I've seen or not seen already. Uh, I'm not going to do this very well, I can tell you that. Oh, I thought I saw there. I thought I saw this earlier too. Ah, I did. Okay. I think I saw this one earlier too. I did. There it was. Again, I'm terrible at these things. Concentration was never my... Uh, okay, what was this again? Dolphin or swordfish? Was that a swordfish? I think it's a swordfish. Marlin, maybe? I don't know. I thought I saw a piggy somewhere. Oh, uh, did I see that guy? Oh, I think I saw the penguin. There we go. Penguin? Lion, uh, ostrich, I don't know. Did I see that? Yep, I thought I saw it. I taught I taught a booty cat. Uh, oh, tarantula. Okay, uh, I think I saw this guy. <laughs> oh, yeah. It, it helps when you limit your choices. <laughs> when the choices are limited, it's easier to figure. Did I see it? Oh, I think I saw... Did I see a piggy here? Oh, there was the piggy. There's the piggy. Okay. Uh, oh, here. Monkey. There we go. I saw it a few times. 
Oh. Uh, no. Oh, there it is. There it is. I thought I saw him earlier. What is this, a lemur or something? Uh, did we see that? And... I don't know. Oh. Uh, no, this guy. Yeah, there we go. Uh, bunny? Okay. <laughs> I thought we saw that one earlier. Okay, uh, snake? Uh, snake? Yep. Uh, dog. Dog. Lion. Uh, nope. There we go. All right. Here it is. Done. Uh, where am I? Becca. 319. 243. Jeez. Good lord. Um, man, do I have to, like, do well in this? Because I'm not going to do well in that at all. Security blotter. Theft. Book from library's special collections. The Black Cat and other short stories. Uh, okay. Five credits are uh, rewarded. Forced entry. Student caught breaking into dorm using their ID card. Keys reportedly locked inside. No damage to door. Theft. Whittier Hall. Missing items. MP3 player. Silver necklace and earrings. Wait. Didn't I see an MP3 player in the Lost and Found? Disturbance. Minor altercation. Two students involved. No injuries reported. Disturbance. Sound violation. Ramsey Hall. Students playing... Musical instruments after lights out. Repeat offender. <laughs> oh, Mel. Mel, Mel, Mel. The campus word. SOS worked. Page two. As you recall, last month I expressed concern that Casper, our beloved resident albino squirrel, faced certain starvation this winter because Waverly's groundskeeper had begun keeping the ground below the oak tree where Casper lives spotlessly clean. Practically every acorn that fell was swept up almost immediately, giving Casper no chance to collect them and store them for the winter. Okay, so maybe the groundskeeper was doing this because of the infamous great popcorn heist back in September, wherein Casper ransacked the backpack of some careless freshman and caused the contents of the bag of popcorn within to get blown from one end of the campus to the other. Yes, Casper made a fat mess, but... Oh, student handbook. Here we go. The rules. Waverly Academy prides itself on fostering a community where students are able to live together in a safe, productive, and welcoming environment. The rules in this guide were created to ensure the continued success in creating this community. Students are expected to follow rules. Any behavior that is in direct violation of the rules will result in disciplinary action. Dorm resident advisors and faculty members are authorized to administer points towards a student's demerit standing. Following are the keystones uh, to maintaining Waverly's community. Honesty. Honesty is expected at all times from students. Lying, cheating, or plagiarism will not be tolerated. Uh, respect for oneself and for others and their property. Any acts or threats of violence will be treated with the utmost seriousness. Punctuality. Students are to be on time for breakfast check-in, classes, study halls, and lights out as outlined in the chart below. Absences due to illness must be reported to and excused by the school nurse. Oh, geez, dude. Time really ticks. Lights out at 10. Wait, are we? we're a senior. We're 11. So we don't have to... Um, we don't have to check in for study, uh, study hall or breakfast, but we do have to have go lights out at 11. Responsibility. All assignments, activities, and athletics are to be conducted and completed in a timely and exemplary fashion. Accountability. Students are responsible for their actions and must be prepared to accept the consequences. Accountability helps students learn how to make good decisions, realize strengths, and increase leadership capabilities. Demerit system. Students who break the rules are given demerits. Any student with 15 or more demerits will be expelled. However, by exhibiting exemplary behavior, students can earn credits to offset any demerits they've acquired. Students can view their current demerit standing by logging into the account on the school website's student life page. 
The below list represents the demerit value of student infractions. Noise violation, failed room inspection, knocking on floor mates doors after lights out, awake in room past lights out, open flame in room, including candles, late to breakfast check-in, skipping daily work study duty, minor vandalism, climbing the front yard oak tree, that's what we did, late to class, inappropriate attire, disrespecting fellow students or faculty. Missing evening study hall, freshmen and sophomores only. Caught in the school halls after lights out. Breaking into another student's room, stealing property. Unauthorized guest in room during daylight hours, act of vandalism. Major property theft, false fire alarms. Unauthorized entrance to locked classroom. Unauthorized town visit, unauthorized overnight guest. Credits are awarded to students who go above and beyond. Any credits earned are deducted from current demerit totals. Completion of volunteer extracurricular projects. Posting the latest high score in double take. Oh, we can reduce our demerits by doing that. Five to nine community service hours in a month. Over 10 community service hours in a month. Working more than required time in daily work study duty. Tutoring underclassmen, approved seniors only, assisting teachers, over 20 community service hours in a month, straight A's awarded at midterm and end of semester. We are three demerits. And everything else is not working. Okay. Okay, so... What can we search? Missing. Okay. Um, okay. So I don't want to search the catalog just yet. I supposed to here go here, but how do I then to? Oh, I didn't have it connected. Okay. About us. Here we go. All right, so we'll upload that. Um, how do I? Okay, I was like, I couldn't move it. Do I have anyone else? Uh, nope, that was it. That's all I had. Okay, so two more. Um, and she will tell us if uh, we need anything else, right? Okay. So I need to do snack shop but i don't know how to get to the snack shop this goes upstairs yep okay so i probably gotta go outside to do the snack shop duties Ooh, now we're outside outside whoa i where are we Dude. Crazy. Okay. Okay. That's a thing. That's a thing. Ramsey Hall. Okay. Interesting. All right. So we can go this way, and we go go this way. So they over here. That's 
it's the albino squirrel. I think they dropped something there. I feel like they dropped something. But I don't know how to get to it. Can I go walk around the tree? Huh. Okay, well then. I don't want to leave just yet. Okay. I can't leave yet. There are still too many strange things going on here. So, oh, the snack bar is uh, in the kitchen, right? Okay, that would make sense, actually. Snack bar is here? Yeah, here we go. All right, snack shop boss orientation guide. The following are the instructions for running the Ramsey Hall snack shop. Shop hours are 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. Upon entering the service area, announce that the snack shop is open and that order can be placed. Individual orders are submitted on a ticket because several tickets may be submitted together. Make sure to scroll through the order list to verify you've filled all of them. Students are permitted only one each of the following items per order. Drink, fruit, sandwich, bag of chips, and dessert. Each ticket shows the items ordered. Place the ordered items on a tray. Serving area has space for two trays, so two orders may be worked on simultaneously. Orders cannot be combined. A tray may only contain items for one order. Don't forget to toast the bread or bagel if requested by the student. Students can request any sandwich filling combination of meat, tomatoes, lettuce, and cheese. Fill a sandwich order exactly as indicated on the ticket. Cookie must be baked in the oven before they are served. When an order is ready, press the pickup call button. If you've filled the order correctly, the tray will be taken away. If the order is incorrect, you must remove the incorrect items and replace them with the correct ones before pressing the pickup call button again. A bell sounds and any currently placed student orders are removed when a teacher places an order. Teacher orders must be filled immediately. You may receive a credit or demerit based on your speed. You must fill at least one full round of orders per day. Failure to do so will result in three demerits. Completing five rounds in a day will award you two credits. Oh man, this sounds complicated. Step right up. The snack shop is open. Okay, so what have we got? Bagel? Uh, bagel? You know, I hate to admit it, but I really like calculus. No, you don't. Got a no, water. I do. I love going to that class. Uh, Everybody corn. does. Mr. Harris is like the best looking teacher in the whole Got universe. Meat. Meat. Uh, wait, three meats? Wait. It's supposed to smell. Oh, that's tomato. Soon. Blizzard type smell. Oh, jeez. Okay. Meat, bagel, meat, 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 water, orange, uh, toasted bread. Uh. Do overs. All right. Trash. Okay, and then uh, got a water for them and chocolate. This is chocolate. Got bread, cheese. I Th think I made a mistake. Oh, I need. Come get your order. Okay, and then. The bagel. Oh, the orders went too quickly. Jeez. Good jeez. Good god. Gravy. Uh, good gravy. How do how do I scroll up? Oh, here we go. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright. Meat. 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 Lettuce. Bagel. Do overs! Go. What? Uh water. Bagel. Meat, 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 lettuce. Bagel, water, orange. This, what is wrong with this? All right, fine, fine. Okay, bagel, meat, 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 lettuce, bagel. Do I better do that over. 
Oh, I see what it's saying. That's... Dude. Okay. So, I gotta do the bottom bagel here. Then put the lettuce, then the meat. Is that what it's saying? I do overs. What? Bagel, water, orange. Uh, water, uh, bagel. Oh, it didn't say toast. That's what's wrong. Ah, oh, Jesus. So I didn't need to toast that bagel. Order up. Okay, there we go. That's what I was doing wrong. Okay. Okay, bagel, meat, bagel, milk, uh, cookies. Where are the cookies? Uh, oh, here we go. Um, chips, pretzels, granolas, nuts. Uh, pretzels? Where are the cookies? I don't... Oh, cookie oven. Wait, how do I get cookies out of the oven? No, that's only if they want it toasted, though. Where, Dude, where are the cookies? Chips, pretzels, granola, nuts... Um, I don't see cookies. Am I blind? Is this a cookie? Okay, put some bread. Toasted bread. Okay, that's the cookie. Okay. Food's ready! Okay. Bread. Cheese. Bread. Water. Uh, orange and chips. Order up! Okay, regular bagel, cheese, meat, tomatoes, water. Oh, wait. Need the other part of the bagel. Cookie. Uh, pretzels. Alright. There. All done. Whoa. Whoa, a key? I wonder what this is to. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Huh. What is this key for? Is it... No, I don't need a key for that. Okay. Huh. Is it for this? No. Is it for this thing? Nope. Okay. I thought there was an MP3 player in here. I guess I was wrong. Can't pick up anything in here. Oh, maybe it's this is if we get something taken from us. No, let me go outside. There was that. There was this thing here. Nope. This. Uh, is, is this the key? Oh, it's the key! Switch. Light. Whoa. Dude. What? Okay. What is this? Science can be fun. Eighth edition. Dr. Detroit. <laughs> Though odds are you'll find this book exceedingly tedious. Interesting. No, that's current assignment uh, what is this candidates huh the human brain and its untapped psychic potential huh. 
Are these missing books? Macroeconomics in French cinema. America, Land of Adventure by Lance Hathaway. Oh. Chapter 2, Regions of the United States. New England states. Huh. Territories. Great Plains, Southeast, Midwest. So, these are the states that make up the different areas that it's breaking up. Okay. And then territories that are owned by the states. I wonder if we need that some way. Hmm. Do I, I, don't, I don't keep the book, do I? Okay. Is there anything else in here? I probably need that book at some point, don't I? Okay, so, but maybe not now. What is all this about? All of these. Huh. All these levers. Must not need to do this just yet. Huh. Interesting. Oh, what's this? It looks like bullet holes or something. What? Huh. What is this thing? Uh-oh. It's almost lights out. I better go back to the room real quick. Or we're gonna get demerits. Alright. Demerits are no good. Alright. This is our room. Do we have time? Um... I don't know, maybe not. What's up, Rumi? I met Leela. She was in the rec room. She's usually in the gym, either bouncing, kicking, hitting, or throwing some kind of ball. You name a sport, she's great at it. And competitive? That girl loves to win, and almost always does. Some really competitive people cheat. Does she? Probably. I mean, I can't prove it, but come on, a jock up for valedictorian? No way. Something's hinky somewhere. And speaking of hinky, she started wrapping her wrist about a week ago, but is it actually hurt? Debatable. Could she be the black cat? Well, she's here on a scholarship, so it's real hard for me to believe she's smart enough to one, secretly be the black cat, and two, divert suspicion by faking an injury and making herself look like a victim of the black cat. But I have to admit, it is possible. That's kind of far-fetched, but I get what you're talking about. Any idea where that book that's missing from the library is? Why? Are you an Edgar Allan Poe fan? Actually, yeah, I am. You and me both. Unfortunately, I don't have a clue who has it. Any idea why it would be missing? Somebody must have wanted that book and not wanted anyone to know they wanted it. That's all I can figure. There has to be records of who took it, though. Did it go missing before or after notes from the black cat started showing up? Before. Right before, in fact. I see what you're getting at. It was called the black cat, wasn't it? That's kind of freaky. Do you know where I can get the key that opens the special collections cabinet in the library? You can get it from me. How bad do you want it? Oh, come on. Uh, kind of bad. There's a book in the collection I'd really like to look at. Okay, here's the deal. I'll give you the key to the cabinet if you can finish these orthographic views for me. How do I do that? Just figure out which views go with which object. Each object has a front, top, and side view. Those are examples in case you need them. 
I can do that. Bring them back when you're done. All right, someone else who needs me to do their work for them. Good gravy. Anything else? I'll see you in a bit. Hasta whatever. Guys, guys, is everyone going to have us do their work for them? I thought they were supposed to be valedictorians. What is going on? Like, everyone has a job for us? I guess that's the way these games go. Just like the way it goes is at this point, I'm going to call it a video. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, lots have happened and more is sure to happen. We're still in the early stages of the game and lots to do, lots to see, and lots to fail at. Anyways, I hope you guys will come back for the next one. And until then, everyone, bye.